So you get a wedding invitation and it says cocktail attire and you're thinking, what actually is cocktail attire? I have invited my little sister, my real little sister, Dana Asher Levine at D Style Dana to join me today and show me what is appropriate. What is cocktail attire? Hello, Hello sister. sister. Sister, I'm so happy to be here and help here to explain what cocktail attire really is. I'm so glad you came over and I saw that you brought a lot of examples to try. Yes, I brought a plethora of dresses and jewels and shoes and bags to get it all dolled up. Because it's not only about the outfit, it's how you accessorize, especially now. Okay. Let's start trying it on. Wow. I love the dress. I love the ballerina style, but I think the skirt is a little too full for you. I mean, I yeah. love all this going on, but I would definitely take some of the volume out definitely of this dress. Slim it down, but I love the flowers like jewelry. You could wear it to a black tie or a cocktail I party. would. I would actually feel really dressy in this. And okay. I love the bracelet. It's kind of edgy too. with the flowers. But Good. I would lose the earrings. Too much going on. Okay. I would do simple earrings. All right. I think you look great. I it. would wear this black tie too. Yes. I just think this looks like jewelry to me. It's just beautiful. I think it's just a little full. Right. And who is this? Reem Accra. Reem Accra. Oh. Love my Reem. Yeah. Friends with Didn't Reem. you wear that to Jordan's I wedding? I wore a Reem Accra gown to my son's That's wedding. Right. Yes. I remember. Manalo shoes, mm -hmm. very simple with any black dress. Yes, absolutely. Perfect. Oh. I think it's too short. It's it's too short. It might be a don't. It's not fit your body I well. Told you it was I mean, too short. Do you think? I, it's too short. It's too really fancy flats. luncheon. I don't like flats or, with it. I just don't love it. I don't like the party. Flats, the length of it. Okay. I think I got one you're gonna like. Okay. Be right back. Wow, that is beautiful, but I think you're trying to compete with the bride. I thought it was too much and that a lot of the times I see guests show up and they kind of want to be the bride or the hostess. If you were going to say a black tie uh, fundraiser, that would be perfect, but yes. not for a wedding. Okay, it, it's Carolina Herrera, yes, right? Yes, Carolina Herrera. And she makes wedding gowns, so, but it sure is pretty. It's convenient. Yeah. And for people who don't want to show their arms, it's great. This is perfection. This is what cocktail attire should look like. A beautiful dress, a great bag, shoes, appropriate jewelry. You look ready to party. I feel like I'm not overdressed, I'm not underdressed. I definitely will wear this to a black tie. I like the ballet kind of look on me. So it's important to buy a dress that fits your body type. Absolutely, and you know, Carolina Herrera is the line for you. Every time you put it on, you look great. Thank you so much. It's like a ballerina fit. Now we all have to dress our age at some point in life. Right. It's so, oh, so true. But this looks beautiful. I think Thank this you. is the winner. I think I'm gonna buy this. Okay, okay. Well, that was exhausting. Let's recap what we learned today. We don't want to compete with the bride or the hostess at the party. You want to dress appropriately, age appropriately. You want your skirt, your dress to be the right length and the right size. When you walk into the room, you want to know that you weren't overdressed or underdressed. Accessories are also important. It was such a great day. Such a great day. So give us a thumbs up today. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel so you don't miss anything. And we hope to be on every Thursday with a new episode. Hey guys, we're not leaving you out. You soon will see what you should wear to a cocktail attire party.